好意思 ，for us to start learning our lessons. Okay. As usual, please listen to the teacher carefully first. Okay. Now we are studying greed, and if we study it thoroughly, we will naturally be afraid of it, and we will not follow it when we are so afraid that it will kill us. The fear of craving is so extreme that we can reach the point of giving up dust and dirt of afflictions when encountering the matters or affairs. We must make clear about what craving is and what it can bring. All sufferings arise from greed, and greed can only attain the infinite attachments and sufferings with the help of our spiritual awareness. Which has all the inherent wisdom. If one has only a little fear of greed and it is difficult to reach a state of extreme fear, that is because of not enough edifying and training. Repeated edifying and training can become a solid concept. The five roots are the process and path of accomplishment, which is needed for any dharma to be accomplished. It includes the analysis of greed, what kind of harm and suffering it brings, and how to subdue greed. Listen to it once more. Now we are studying greed, and if we study it thoroughly, we will naturally be afraid of it, and we will not follow it when we are so afraid that it will kill us. The fear of craving is so extreme that we can reach the point of giving up dust and dirt of afflictions when encountering the matters or affairs. We must make clear about what craving is and what it can bring. All sufferings arise from greed. And greed can only attain the infinite attachments and sufferings with the help of our spiritual awareness, which has all the inherent wisdom. If one has only a little fear of greed and it is difficult to reach a state of extreme fear, that is because of not enough edifying and training. Repeated edifying and training can become a solid concept. The five roots are the process and path of accomplishment, which is needed for any dharma to be accomplished. It includes the analysis of greed. What kind of harm and suffering it brings, and how to subdue greed. Now I'm going to explain it in brief. Okay, vigorous. Let's begin. Now we are studying greed, and if we study it thoroughly, thoroughly. Thoroughly means completely, completely. We were not, we were naturally be afraid of it. We were naturally be afraid of it. Be afraid of means feel, feel, and we will not follow it. When we are so afraid that it will kill us, it means when we are so afraid, we are so afraid that it will kill us. Then we will not follow greed. We will not we will not follow greed. The fear of grieving is so extreme that we can reach the point of giving up dust and the dirt of addictions when encountering the matters of affairs. So that so that. When encountering the matters or affairs means when meeting the matters or affairs, we must make clear about what craving is and what it can bring. We must make clear about what craving is and what craving or greed. Can bring. 
All sufferings arise from greed, and greed can only attain the infinite attachments and the sufferings with the help of our spiritual awareness, which has all the inherent wisdom. Attain, here means attain, means achieve, achieve. All sufferings arise from greed, and the greed can only achieve the infinite, infinite attachments and the sufferings with the help of our spiritual awareness, mm. which has all inherent wisdom, inherent wisdom. Inherent wisdom means the wisdom within, the wisdom within. If one has only a little feel of a great, and it is difficult to reach a state of extreme feel, It means if one is a little afraid of greed. It is difficult, then it is difficult for him to reach a state of extreme, of extreme fear. That is because of not enough edifying and training. That is because of, because of means due to. That is due to not enough edifying and training. Edifying and training. Repeated edifying and training can become a solid concept. Repeated edify and training means edifying and training over and over again and again can become a solid concept. Can form, can form, as become means form, can form a solid concept. The five roots are the process and the path of accomplishment, which is needed for any Dharma to be accomplished. The five roots are the process and the path of accomplishment, which is needed for any Dharma. Or any, or any Buddha Dharma to be accomplished. Accomplished means achieved, to be achieved. It includes the analysis of great. What kind of harm and suffering it brings and how to subdue great. It includes one, two, three. It includes three. Three items. It includes three items. The analysis, the analysis of grade, the analysis of grade. This is the first. What kind of harm and suffering it brings? The second, and how to subdue greed? This is the third. Okay. That's the that's the explanation. That's all for the explanation. Now, please listen to the teacher once again. Okay. Now we are studying greed, and if we study it thoroughly, 
we will naturally be afraid of it, and we will not follow it when we are so afraid that it will kill us. The fear of craving is so extreme that we can reach the point of giving up dust and dirt of afflictions when encountering the matters or affairs. We must make clear about what craving is and what it can bring. All sufferings arise from greed, and greed can only attain the infinite attachments and sufferings with the help of our spiritual awareness, which has all the inherent wisdom. If one has only a little fear of greed and it is difficult to reach a state of extreme fear, that is because of not enough edifying and training. Repeated edifying and training can become a solid concept. The five roots are the process and path of accomplishment, which is needed for any dharma to be accomplished. It includes the analysis of greed, what kind of harm and suffering it brings, and how to subdue greed. Once again. Now we are studying greed, and if we study it thoroughly, we will naturally be afraid of it, and we will not follow it when we are so afraid that it will kill us. The fear of craving is so extreme that we can reach the point of giving up dust and dirt of afflictions when encountering the matters or affairs. We must make clear about what craving is and what it can bring. All sufferings arise from greed, and greed can only attain the infinite attachments and sufferings with the help of our spiritual awareness, which has all the inherent wisdom. If one has only a little fear of greed and it is difficult to reach a state of extreme fear, that is because of not enough edifying and training. Repeated edifying and training can become a solid concept. The five roots are the process and path of accomplishment, which is needed for any dharma to be accomplished. It includes the analysis of greed, what kind of harm and suffering it brings, and how to subdue greed. Okay, now it's time for us to practice reading them. Now, we are studying greed, and if we study it thoroughly, we will naturally be afraid of it, and we will not follow it when we are so afraid that it will kill us. The fear of craving is so extreme that we can reach the point of giving up dust and dirt of our afflictions when encountering the matters or affairs. We must make clear about what craving is and what it can bring. Okay. It's your turn. Vigorous, are you ready? Yeah, good evening, Ogo. Okay, no. please go ahead. Yeah. Now we are studying greed. And if we study it thoroughly, we will naturally be afraid of it. And we will not follow it. When we are so afraid that it will kill us, kill us. The fear of yes, craving. Yes, kill us. Kill us. Ah, yes. Kill us. Perfect. Yeah. Very good. Thank Go you. On, please. The, the fear <laughs> of craving is so extreme that so extreme that we can reach the point of giving up. That's and that of obligations we encounter in the matters of 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 fields. We must make clear about what craving is and what it can bring. Wonderful. Okay, let's go on. All sovereigns are all sovereigns arise from greed, and the greed can only attain the infinite attachment and the sufferings with the help of our spiritual awareness, which has all the inherent wisdom. If one has only a little feel of greed, and it is difficult to reach a state of extreme feel, that is because of not enough edifying and training. Repeated edifying and training can become a solid concept. Okay? It's your turn. Yeah. Please. All sufferings arise from greed, and greed can only attain the infinite attachments and the sufferings with the hope of our spiritual awareness, which has already in inherent with them. If one has only a little feel of greed, and it is difficult to 
reach a state of extreme fear. That is because of not enough edifying and training repeated. Edifying and then training can become a sol sol solid com concept. 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 Yes, concept. Concept. The five okay. roots are the process. The five, let's go on. Okay. The five roots are the process and the path of accomplishment which is needed for any Dharma to be accomplished. It includes the analysis of greed, what kind of harm and suffering it brings, and how to subdue greed. Okay, it's your turn, Vigorous. The five rules are the pro process the, and the path of accomplishment, which is needed for any demo to be accomplished. It includes close the an an analysis of greed. Analysis. 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 Yes. Analysis. Yeah. Analysis of greed. What kind of harm and the suffering it brings and how to subdue greed. Thank you. Wonderful, wonderful. Okay, okay. Now I think here is here is everyone hosting the lecture. Okay. The rest of the time, the rest of the time is for you, vigorous. Okay. Now I'll put it on my mic. Vigorous, please. Yes. Come on, Vigorous. Yeah. Come yeah. on, good everyone. Evening. Yes. Yeah, good evening, Hugo. Thank you for help teaching teach him uh, my English. Yes. Now we are studying greed, and if we study it thoroughly, we will naturally be afraid of it, and we will not follow it. When we are so afraid that it will kill us, the fear, fear of craving is so extreme that we can reach the point of giving up, thus and that of obligations. When encountering the matters or obvious, we must make clear about what craving is and what it can bring. All suffering, sufferings all arise from greed. And the greed can and the greed can only, only attain the infinite. Only attain. Only attain the, the infinite attachment and the sufferings with the hope of our spiritual awareness, which has all the inherent wisdom. If one has only a little feel of greed and it is difficult of reach a state of extreme fear, that is because of not enough. Edifying and then training, repeated edifying and training is the only way to become a sol solid, solid concept. The five rules are the pro process and then pass of accomplishment, which is needed for any demo to be accomplished. It includes clues. The an 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 analysis 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 of greed. What kind of harm and suffering it brings, and how to subdue greed. Yeah. 
Now we are studying Greek, and if we study it thoroughly, we will naturally be afraid of it, and we will not follow it. When we are so afraid that it will kill us, the fear of craving is so extreme that we can reach the point of giving up. Thus and that of afflictions when encountering encountering the matters of affairs. We must make clear about what craving is and what it can bring or sufferings arise from greed. And greed can only attain the infinite attachment and the sufferings with the hope hope of our spiritual awareness, which has all the inherent wisdom, if one has only a little fear of greed and it is difficult to reach a state of extreme fear, that is because of not enough edifying and training. Repeated edifying and training is the only way to become a so solid, solid concept. The five rules are the poor Pro proceed and the pass and and the pass of accomplish, accomplishment, which is needed of for any dharma to be accomplished. It it includes the an analysis of greed, what kind of harm and suffering it brings, and how to subdue greed. Yeah, last time. Now we are studying greed, and if we study it thoroughly, we will naturally be afraid of it, and we will not follow it. When we are so afraid that it will kill us, the fear of craving is so extreme that we can reach the point of giving up. Thus and that of obligations when encountering the matters of, of race. We must make clear about what craving is and what it can bring. All sufferings arise from greed, and the greed can only attain then the infinite attachment and the sufferings with the hope of our spiritual awareness, which has already inherited. With them, you one has only a little fear of greed, and it is difficult to reach a state of extreme fear. That is because of not, not enough edifying and training. Repeated edifying and training is the only way to become a so, solid concept. The five rules are the process and the path of accomplishment, which is needed for any dharma to be accomplished. It includes the an analysis, analysis of green, what kind of harm and suffering it brings, and how to subdue greed. Yeah, now I want read. Read. Read practice paragraph. Yeah, read, read max. All beings continue to live and die, and the cycle of rain rain reincarnation is endless. The fifth chapter of the Sutra of the Great Square 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 White and then Perfect in E L Enlightenment, 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 and are all ultimate clear mean, meanings. Says 
Good means all essential means have been re reincarnated because of various kinds of con 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 yeah, okay. Please hook up. Okay. Vigorous. Now I'm going to recite, read and recite this paragraph. Okay. First of all, I'm going to read it. The five roots are the process and the path of accomplishment, which is needed for any Dharma to be accomplished. It includes the emphasis of greed, what kind of harm and suffering it brings, and how to subdue greed. Okay, now I'm going to recite it. The five rules are the process and the path of accomplishment, which is needed for any Dharma to be accomplished. It includes the analysis of greed, what kind of harm and suffering it brings, and how to subdue greed. Am I okay? Yeah, okay, maybe right. Thank okay. you, Vigorous. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Thank yeah, you for thank your you. encouragement. <laughs> okay, you can go on. I mean, yeah. uh, I'll put it on my mic. Thank you. Yeah. Uh, okay. Um, again, re read again. Great men or sentient beings have been Re reincarnated because of various kinds of con conjure, 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 love and then read scenes, the beginning less, lessness, lessness. Therefore, if beings want to get right, right of life and death to avoid all the re reincarnation, is they should should first cut off greed and in in eliminate greedy love with thirst. Five greed greed makes sentient beings always do not get what they want. When people are greedy, they often stay they often say and do things there are. Country, country, contrary, contrary to their wishes and then desire, desires. That why Buddha said upside down beings have upside down thinking, upside down doing, and they have we vicious like cycles. Psycho, Volume one of the Sutra of Great Buddha's Summit. 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 And the first Sura Suragama says, all sentient beings have had all kinds of provisions, and the naturally, 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 karmic says, like we. Vicious cycles since the beginninglessness greed obstructs the wisdom, marriage, and the virtues that the Buddha posit, po, posit, posit, po, possesses, possesses, possesses originally, originally, so it is also called. The ups up ups abstain 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 of obligations in Buddhism. Other ex, ex, example is volume of the Avatam Tam Sak Saka Sutra, which says the Buddha's wisdom are everywhere. What is the reason? There is no single being who does not possess. The wisdom of the task gathers, but who does not attain is due to delusions, per 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 
provisions and the attachments if one is filled from the full thinking. All wisdom, natural wisdom, and heart and unhand hundred hundred unhindered wisdom with will be real realized or re revealed. The four thinking thinkings here in include greed and other obligations. If we know the horror and the harm of greed and the delusions which obstructs our or original wisdom, merit and the virtues and the all wisdom, natural wisdom and the unhindered Unhindry wisdom of the Buddhas, we will naturally feel and stay away from greed and other big big system and the false thinkings. Seven greed can make sentient beings as if they will en entering entering entering. Entering the sea of miasma or poison or poisonous gas in volume eight of the Su Surigama Sutra, it is said that we we are Buddha Bodhis Bodhisattva says greed. He will be like avoiding the sea of miasma. One of Bodhisattva says greed. It is it is like seeing the sea of miasma and then must be avoid, avoiding. What does miasma mean? It is a kind of po poison, poisonous gas. Poisonous. Poisonous gas. People will have different pe per per perceptions of different miasma and then poisonous gas. And once they are poisoned, they do not want to come out of it alive. For example, carbon, monoxide, monoxide, monoxide can make people die unknowing, unknowingly and then pay painlessly. Why will carbon monoxide let people die without pay? Because it causes the body to lack oxygen. Oxygen. If a person person's mouth and mouth and nose are covered, and their body is deprived of oxygen, the person will not die of com comfort comfortably, but combo no mon monoxide can make a, a person die comfort comfort comfortably. Greed is also like carbon monoxide, which can make people unconscious unconscious unconsciously, 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 pace, painlessly, and comfort, comfort, com comfortably suffer from the, the hardships of the three commas of the mind, body and mouth. They're running, 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 running out of the oil of the lap of your body and mind, and even go, go into this or if even, even all the seas of sufferings. Eight, greed can make people lowly, lowly in their place of the Buddha's conduct. It is said that greed love makes people in inferior. Why does greedy love make people lowly? People have only happiness and no suffering 
originally because greed, greedy love naturally product, productive products, products. Produces, produces the age sufferings following, following so that there are re reduced, reduced from open pa pattern, pattern of noble, noble and happiness to a lowly pattern of the age sufferings, which is lowly enough. Therefore, greedy love can make people lowly or in, inferior. Chapter three, how to subdue greed. Now that we know that greed can bring us in immense harm and suffering, how can we subdue and then extinguish greed, greedy desire, desire? The more detail and then pre Precise, precise, the understanding, knowledge, and then knowledge, knowledge, and the observation of greed is form one, the better and then fast, faster, faster one can subdue it so that one can live suffering and attain happiness for oneself and others and subdue subdue their demons and achieve the unsurpassed path of Buddhas as soon as pos per pos per possible possible the king and the knack to subduing greed it one whether their insight is correct correct from the first so sort of the inclu inclu inclusion, the initial initial inclusion power, the inclusion of lives lives and then generations and even to pre present present inclusion of all me new 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 me numinous. New, new, new minus source, source. Sentient beings think that greed is the best. The inclusion of this knowledge and the view is too large, too long, and too strong. The inclusion of the Buddha, Dharma, and the Dharma's knowledge, view, and the wisdom is too small, too weak, and too feeble. feeble. Volume 2 of the Sura Gamma Sutra says, Why are there five skandhas? Originally, the wonderful dustness or self nature of that, that past goddess, 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 gaba, and goddess. Gather grab 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 another for example there is a man who with pure eyes sees and then sees the clear and then bright bright sky sky the only clean void and then there is nothing at all he does not move his eyes for no reason but still at, at it with his eyes without stop, that he sees not only crazy, crazy flower, flowers in the empty space, but also all the cr crazy and not, not ex existent. The same is true of the form me material, material, scan, scan, scan. Skanda, Skanda. In volume 10 of the Suragama Sutra, it is said, fin finally, 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 finally. 
Finally, finally, if you if if you appear bright, clear, and I'm I'm moving, state is pre permanent, pre permanent, permanent. Then then there should be no seeing, hearing, awareness, or knowing in your body if it is gen gen generally gen gain gain. Gen genuinely, genuinely pure and true, it should not contain habit or falseness. How does it happen? Then that have having seen some un unusual, 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 unusual. You draw seen in the past. You e eventually forget forget it over over time and until until ne ne neither neither memory now forget forget fondness fondness of it remain, but then later upon sun suddenly suddenly. Saying that you, you, you un, unusually, unusual, unusual scene again, again, you remember it clear, clearly from before without, without forgetting a sight, a single, 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 single detail. How can you keep track? track? How, can, how can you keep? Track, track of the per permit 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 permission permission that goes on in thought after thought in this pure, clear and unmoving conscious consciousness. That's why your seeing, hearing, awareness, and knowing are pre pre presently strong strong. Together by some subtle, subtle habits, so that within the profound clarity, existence, existence, exist, existence, and the non non exist non existence are both un, unreal. The, this is the fifth kind of ups, upside down. Me, me, me too. Mean to mean meaning to meaning to lady meaning to meaning to me minutely minutely start thinking with us learn why do people get greedy greedy why where does greed come from come from it comes from staring at the sun something so long and becoming sick from what one thinks, from what one define, defines, from one's own for thinking of a per, 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 permission from one's upside down, minutely subtle thinking. All the good and bad things come from staring at something so long and becoming sick. There are all, all kind of, of face of sickness at your present level. And then there, are, there is nothing in the first place. There are just the, the face of sickness that re relies, uh, relies on your Self nature and displays. It is only good if you if you confirm film confirm film film confirm film confirm 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 it is good, but it, it is not good. If you think it is not good, and there are some things. We we think this this good good bring 
are the eight sufferings. For example, what we like to feel and, and feel good. You think it is good because you in 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 initially 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 think it is good and it is good because you is is establish the knowledge knowledge and view that it is good at the beginning. Why does one feel the face of the disease? Disease is good. It is because one per per permit 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 permitted permitted and one thinks it is good. Some people say I create grief two more dump dump doubly doubling doublings or two few doublings. It doesn't of affect myself. Doublings are what I can what I can eat. Shit of dust of dust, dust is what I can eat. With what I can't eat. This is a question question of insight, which is formed from the first thought of include inculcation at the beginning. If the first thought of incul inculcation, incul inculcation being inculcated from our childhood does. Is that doshik doshik is delicious and then in the in in the in in the book. Endeavor, 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 endeavor. Oh, edible and then dumplings are not edible. Then we will only eat dark, dark shit now, not dumplings. So there is a most initial power of inculcation, inculcation, inculcation. In or oh, incarcation, oh, sorry, incarcation about this. There even every sort of incarcation, incarcation, incarcation. And then we form our own fi fi fixed power of knowledge and the view. Therefore, the Buddha said that all beings in the world are full, full of e evil views. And there are four of vigorously evil views. They greed, hatred, ignorance, arrogance, and doubt. We have now such as greed, greed for greed, good food, good clothing, clothes, good farm, good play, pleasure. Think that doublings are good, are good and doorship, inedible. Have been in incarcation, incarcated, incarcated, have been incarcated firmly, and even now we are still incarcating them in every sort because they have, have been incarcated for too long and too stronger. This is one as, as, aspect. Aspect on the on the other hand, in in Buddhism, we are also inculcating this knowledge and the view, but the inculcating is too small, too weak. If these two views appear at the same time, then naturally the pre pre previous preview real preview. Previous, previous state, same consciousness, consciousness is great, greater than the wisdom consciousness. And if they really fight the wisdom consciousness, we will not be able to complete, complete it with the state consciousness. So 
there is the question question of faith that is whether um has the faith of con con conditions or the true faith in the buddha the dharma and the sangha this will be this disgust 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 in detail later example one of edification in eating muggins eating la leaf muggins eating a big bit of live muggin cheese have you ever eaten the eggs of of, of life is called muggins in 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 It leads say sa sudden 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 muscle is all cheese covered with leaf mug muggins. This smelly, smelly cheese is full of bad smell and muggins that are we wriggling re re around inside the cheese. When you open the cheese, you can you can clearly see see them. They look looks love this baby. Why some su sudden 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 juice? believe this nourish nourishes the in and the young but in real 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 reality 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 because it is delish delicious and the taste of life mug 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 cheese is you unique unique Please don't make a fool and then be dis disgusted and then and then vomit 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 after after reading this reading this because everything is edified and then there are all char char character character Characteristics, char char characteristics of sickness form due to staring at something with your eyes. Think about why most of us do do, do not go to eat muggins. It is because we have no edify, edification about them, and then and when we say others do so, we are only dis disgust, disgust, disgust. Example two of edify, edify, edification. Some people have to wear clothes, clothes, and they can't do it if they don't. One, what them? If we ask her to take off her clothes now, she won't. She won't take them open, even take them off, even if we we kill her. Why? Because it has been edified too long and so and solidly, solid, 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 solidly. And then she has has a stare at it with her eyes, and then generated sickness to long. Example three of edification. For example, if some pre primi, primitive tri, tribi, tri, tribus, 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 tribus,
of all Afri Afri African African Africa Africa and and South America. They they all do not wear clothes. If they see us wearing clothes to go there, they will feel their Strange, strange. There is a boy or a video capture capture. They they for foresee forcibly 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 for forcibly strip 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 stripped re report reporter of whole and and well because they have seen outsiders wearing out out outer 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 well a little more but have not seen the and and well the stripped of the and well then a, a large group of women all grab 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 it it as if they got their spoils of will a war a war a war in their view wearing clothes is straight strange 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 Strange, 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 and gra grabbing, grabbing. They that seem to study for half the day. They do not know what to do. Example four of edification. Furthermore, people in in the 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 Indonesia, 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 and the Ma Ma Malaysia, Ma Ma Malaysia, Malaysia, it leave chicken cuts, put them in their mouth of to eat. The chicken legs are still key, key, still king. kicking, kicking, kicking to their tongues. They do not spit, and then also can eat them inside. Then they chew they them, con con country country crunch 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 even the swell. So, so well, the chicken has chicken buttocks, chicken in testes, and the chicken down. Why can they eat them? The fact is they, that the appearance of sickness of staring at it with eyes here is too heavy. Why can't we do this. It is that we never think that is good. Example five of edification. There are also you 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 know unices 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 who eat worms. Now you have to eat worms. Can can you eat them? Why can they eat them and come and come to? It is because of the edification from childhood. In real in reality, reality that we think what is good and what is bad is just the kind of include inculcation from child childhood, and even the inculcation from the beginning less less lessness. Yeah, okay. It's time o'clock. Thank you for your time. Thank you everyone. Put on my mic.